Opera Theater is bringing the Opera Ball event. Uh, the best party in town back to Honolulu, and this year's theme is East Meets East. And joining us now is the Hawaii Opera Directive, Executive Director, Simon Kirkall, to tell us about it. Thanks for joining us this morning. Thank you, Laura. Good to be here. Well, yeah. let's talk about um, the theme this year. Uh, I saw Turn Dot. It was so great, and the, the set you. was beautiful. And it's all part of that theme of, because that's ch set in China. Well, East Meets East. So we start East. with China mm -hmm. this year in, in Turn Dot, but set in Beijing. And then we end up with Mikado uh, at the end of the season in June. And that's an opera set in Japan of a kind. It's really a British opera, uh, poking fun at the British, but set in Japan. So it's set in the town of Titipu. Titipu, okay. <laughs> Interesting, how titillating. Um, so let's talk about So it was a great turnout, too. This it is was, really neat. It was really good. For, turn, for uh, Turandot, right? We worked very hard on the marketing. And what was great to see was that uh, of the audience that we brought in, 22% of the households were new to opera, that is new really to Hawaii wonderful. Opera Theatre. So talking so about uh, bringing in uh, funds and raising money, the, the Opera Ball, this is so important to you guys. It's a great night, yeah. and it's a great night of celebration. It's a, a celebration of the beginning of the season, and it's a grand night. It's black tie, and people can wear their fancy uh, outfits. But the important thing is the money we raise, which is to enable us to continue presenting opera of very high quality. And, and a wonderful also, invitation. Can we show the invitation oh, really sure, quick yeah. here? Can you guys get a tight shot of that? I've got to show this because this, they're so creative. I take a look yeah, at that. Yeah, that's, that's the, it's a fan. That's the invitation to the opera ball. But anyway, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're fine. Like, it's kind of cute. Focus. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this is great too because you're saying that this is um, what you guys do uh, year round. For education. Yes. Fantastic. Well, people tend to forget that when we're not on stage doing big, spectacular opera, we're in the schools and educating the children and introducing them to this wonderful art form. So uh, we've just finished one uh, tour of our school performance of Mikado, which has been around uh, Oahu. We're heading over to the Big Island mm -hmm. and Maui and Kauai in the spring. Uh, but we also go into schools. We're, we're in residence at the Blanche Pope Elementary at the moment helping the kids to put on their own opera and that's really fun because they so get neat. to be the singers they get to write the script they get to design the costumes and the sets and they put on their own operas. It's Creating really fun. Creating generations of fans and talent. Thank fans you and so talent, much exactly. again. Uh, the yeah. Opera Ball, the fundraising event this Saturday, uh, November 16th at the Sheraton Waikiki Ball. Simon, thanks so much for joining Thank us. Thank you, Lara. Good to be here. All right, coming up next, uh, the latest on Typhoon Haiyan and the dispute.